SmackDown Live, Alexa Bliss had taken the championship from me and held on to it thanks to an alliance with somebody I never expected, Mickey James. Becky Lynch looking like she'd seen a ghost. Mickey James just handed that championship to Alexa Bliss. With Elimination Chamber coming up, I was hungry for some revenge. But at the same time, though, it was surreal. Mickey's one of the greatest champions of all time. I'd watch Mickey on Raw before it even started my career. I used to watch her and Trish and Lita growing up. So yeah, I, I had kind of looked up to Mickey James in the past. By the time Elimination Chamber rolled around, those days were over. Big match here tonight for Becky Lynch against the veteran Mickey James. This is huge for Mickey James. A lot of people are wondering if she's still got it. What's she gonna bring to the table? Well, think about Becky Lynch today. Think about how this would propel her shoulders oh. down. Huh? Another close call there. Think about how this would propel Becky Lynch's career to another level. This is a moment down again. This is a moment that Becky Lynch has been waiting for. These women oh, just oh, oh, all, oh, over the, all over the ring. Yeah, rolling outside the ring now. Still locked up, Becky and Mickey. Here we go, Becky Lynch, Mickey James. Two generational talents colliding. These two ladies better watch the count. Time to get back in the ring, ladies. Focus. Becky standing toe to toe with Mickey James. Both women back in to break the count. Both these ladies back in the ring, squaring off. We just saw a stalemate between Becky and Mickey. Neither woman is looking to back down. There's a lot they want to prove to one another. And another reversal. Seems like we're back where we began, Michael. Uh -oh. the arm. Oh, man. Ooh, Becky just aggressively going after that arm. Mickey James was able to get out of there. A striking blow. by Becky Lynch. Oh, a jumping arm breaker. In a bad way here, guys. There's no doubt that Becky Lynch is one of the cornerstones of the women's revolution. And I'm glad you recognize that, Michael, because lately I think Mickey James has been a bit delusional. I mean, she's been trying to discredit Becky Lynch, saying she had nothing to do with the women's revolution. Yeah, but on the flip side of that, Saxon, I don't think Becky Lynch has gone far enough to show respect for Mickey James, a woman who is breaking barriers for Becky to be here today. Oh, what do you want Becky to do? Bow down at Mickey James' feet? I mean, that'd be a strong start. Mickey James seizing the moment that time. Nice drop kick. Oh, the reversal by Becky Lynch. Oh, Becky just in full control here. A great suplex by Becky. The man connects. Out the uh -oh. oh my goodness, crushing it! Oh God, Lynch looking to destroy the arm. You have to admire the craftiness of Mickey James. Started training for a career in sports entertainment in 1999. A multiple time champion here at WWE. Who wants to prove that? Well, her generation still has a lot left in the tank. The well, fact is, if Mickey had stayed with WWE this entire time, she'd probably be a 10-time champion. Probably Becky Lynch would have been a never was if Mickey had stuck around. I doubt that would be true. And the fact still remains, Mickey's been off for seven years. Hasn't been competing with the same frequency Becky Lynch has. Many things have changed since Mickey's time in the rise of the women's revolution. Mickey's come back and feels that everything Becky has accomplished, she should be thanking her for it, Four. like Becky didn't earn it on her own. I mean, come on, Becky was SmackDown's first draft Four. pick, the inaugural women's champion, and would have been a two-time champion if it wasn't for Mickey. Six. 
Wait, now, we don't know for sure that Becky Lynch would have been a two-time champion. Alexa Bliss was always in control of the situation. Check your eyes, Graves. Becky was just moments away. Alexa was ready to tap and tell James to the party. Alexa was playing possum. She had Becky right where she wanted her. Get off whatever planet you're on, Graves. We're going to need you down on Earth here at some... Here comes the man! Becky Lynch is rolling. The Irish last kicker fired up! Going for the cover. One, I thought that was it. I'm wow. having a hard time believing that one. Mickey James has been describing the current generation as this selfish generation. That the women today don't have the respect for the history before them. It's really nice to have everything handed to you and ride this wave. Wait, wait, nothing's been handed to Becky Lynch. Let me finish, Renee. It's unfair and unjust for Becky Lynch to be told she's a leader of amazing women superstars. And actually, the movement was going on well before her time. This has become a monumental struggle for these competitors. It is down to who still has the energy, the resolve, to put the pedal to the metal. Driven down face first. by Becky Lynch. For the first time tonight, Becky Lynch is looking to fly. Grand Elimination Chamber with Becky Lynch and Mickey James looking to... All the way for the top. Whoa, Unbelievable athleticism. Climbing the ropes again. Look out. The question that has been posed all week is, does Mickey James have a right to think she has something to do with the women's revolution? Listen, Mickey James probably feels a bit jaded. She probably has years of pent up frustration from not being that woman in the spotlight. With all the women that emerged during her absence, Mickey has an uphill battle. She's out here to prove that she belongs. Renee, it might be a hard test, but she has the experience to back it up. Mickey James has beaten Hall of Famers. She's beaten Trish Stratus. She's been to WrestleMania. She's seen it all. How about another? Becky Lynch is keeping a very good tempo. Going to have a hard time stopping Becky when she's doing this. Not again. One of these competitors is eventually going to have to gain the upper hand. There is some extra vitriol in Becky tonight. You can tell she's carrying a mission of vengeance in the ring. Yeah, that's the kind of attitude you can expect from Becky after Mickey cost Becky the championship. Having that title is the most important thing in Becky's life. And Becky believes that her road back to the championship starts by slapping Mickey James back to the past. What? Becky Lynch. 
The WWE Universe in Phoenix is behind the Irish last kicker. Hoping to see this match end with Mickey James in the disarmor. That's going to be a difficult challenge for Becky to pull off. The veteran Mickey James knows how to use every part of the ring to her advantage. Mickey has truly been a ring general throughout her career, but Becky has hundreds of ways to attack her opponent's arm. Mickey James is well aware of that fact. Every person in this capacity crowd is on their feet. And with good reason. These superstars are earning all of their respect. She returns the favor there. Back between the ropes. Becky Lynch said on the kickoff show that she's been watching Mickey James matches to prepare for tonight. And that there goes to show how Becky Lynch does have tremendous respect for Mickey James talent. Becky might have done her due diligence in preparation for this match, but it still seems like Becky wants to act like a pioneer of the women's revolution. When in fact, Mickey James was leading revolutions before they were even a cool thing to talk about. She's toying with her now. Thank you, Lynch. Disarmor! It's gotta be over! Nope, she releases it. Well, that decision may very well come back to haunt her, Cole. Becky looking for the disarmor. Can she put Nikki James away? Almost got her. Almost got her position. Great counter, shoulders down. Becky rolls through into a 